get to this Thursday morning. Of course, we're thinking of those killed and hurt in that terrible accident at the Ohio State Fair. And such a scary moment for all the families there. And these are fairs that a lot of us have attended over sure. the years. And there are so many of these fairs that are still going on across the country. Yeah, this was the first day of the Ohio State Fair when that popular fireball ride broke apart in midair. You see it right there. At least one person was killed, as Robin said. Seven others injured. This morning, all rides at the Ohio State Fair are shut down. ABC's Alex Perez is on the scene in Columbus with the latest. Good morning, Alex. Good morning, George. Authorities have been here through the night. There's still a lot of unanswered questions. It was a beautiful day. Families were out when suddenly everything turned into a living nightmare. Overnight, a horrifying crash at the Ohio State Fair on a ride called the Fireball. Listen as the swinging ride begins to break apart. At least two riders thrown at high speeds through the air. One found 50 feet from the ride. A full car of the ride coming off. This video posted to social media captured the terrifying incident. Seven people injured, five in critical condition, and an 18-year-old man killed. Bystanders and first responders are rushing to aid the injured. Can you help? Somebody's up there on the ride. Police and investigators quickly shutting the fair down. We will begin an investigation on this to determine what the failure was, if any, and how this accident occurred. The Ohio State Fair was scheduled to run until August 6th. Last year, it attracted nearly 1 million visitors. But now, Ohio's governor, John Kasich, ordering all rides closed until the investigation is complete and additional safety inspections can be conducted. The fair is about the best things in life, and with this accident, it becomes a terrible terrible tragedy. ABC station WSYX was with inspectors before the fair opened. We will periodically do spot checks just to ensure all that stuff is in place. Overnight in California, the Orange County Fair shutting down a ride similar to the fireball as a precaution. This morning, investigators examining this terrifying video for answers about what caused this terrible tragedy. We're really, really shocked because I think they do take really good care in trying to prevent this kind of thing. And inspections records show ins the ride passed all inspections uh, yesterday. The fair will be open today, but all rides will remain shut down until investigators can pinpoint what exactly went wrong here. Robin? All right, Alex, thank you. Well, I thought it was a good idea to, for me to chime in on this because that is one of my most favorite rides when it comes to town here. I don't know about you, but that ride kind of gives gets that adrenaline pumping and it kind of makes me want to just ride more rides. And so when I saw that, I was thinking to myself, oh my God, the, my thoughts of being thrown away from this ride because of some loose screw can happen. And it can happen and it did happen. So beware wherever your state fair is and it has that ride because I know ours, the one that comes here, has that ride and I had that same thought in my mind what if this thing came loose and flew and just slung me away and that's what happened to those people so keep those people in your thoughts and prayers and the families and I hope everyone is okay uh, who survived uh, I guess the one 18 year old male uh, didn't make it but the rest of them did so uh, our thoughts and prayers go out to that family mm -mm -mm.